everybody, and happy Monday to you. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and start this off with a little bit of bad news, but I have some good news. Sadie is not going to be able to be doing this anymore, just hopefully for a while. She just has a lot going on, and so she's not able to do it. But I don't want to just not do it anymore because I know you guys look forward to the videos and I look forward to you guys looking forward for, to the videos. So I'm going to continue to do them and just take over temporarily. And I'm going to bring in my sisters and my mom and just other people so they can kind of fill in. Um, so I hope that's okay with you guys. I'm really sorry, but I just would hope you guys would rather have something rather than nothing. So all that out of the way. Since it's Valentine's Day this week, I got a little something something just to be a little festive. And I think it's kind of cute. I got it from Target for a dollar, but I'm not going to wear it the whole time because it's kind of distracting and it kind of gets on my nerves. Um, so if you can't tell from that, I'm going to be talking about love. And some of you are in relationships and dating someone, which is cool. Or some of you are like me who are single as a Pringle, which is also fun. I'm okay with that. Um... So, I just feel like nowadays dating is kind of put on a pedestal and just kind of like a priority, I guess. And you're just expected to date or have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. And it just kind of gets on my nerves nowadays. And um, I guess I just wanted to take this opportunity to just tell you guys that you don't got to do that. And you see on Twitter all the time, mainly from the girls, um, who are, and actually some guys too, who are just like, I don't have a Valentine and nobody's going to buy me anything and blah, blah, blah. And I'm just like, okay, come on, you can, you know, go buy your own box of chocolates. That's what my mom's always told me any time, which is pretty much the last 17 years of my life that I haven't had Valentine. And my mom's just like, Colby, do not even try to whine about it or be upset about it. You can go buy your own teddy bear and treat yourself because that's okay. You don't have to whine and mope around because you don't have a Valentine because you're better than that. And you guys are better than that. And I just, I just think that, like I said, nowadays it's just all about dating and relationships and blah 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 and I'm just like you know why like what's the point we we don't need to have someone to make us feel worthy and you don't need to have a boyfriend or a girlfriend to make yourself feel good about yourself you can do that yourself and you can do that by having a really good relationship with Christ and it's just it's just kind of sad to me that People are so needy when it comes to needing someone to continue to continue and always tell you, oh, you're pretty or you're handsome or you're this and you're that. And, and then you let that decide your worth and you let that decide how you feel about yourself. And that's not okay and it's really sad. And I've done it before. I have thought that you kind of needed that to feel good about yourself, but you don't. And what I've learned over the last few months that... My relationship has grown a lot stronger with the Lord, and I'm so thankful for it. And this Valentine's, I'm just like, you know what? I do have a Valentine. I have him, and he decides my worth, and he's made it very clear that we are so worthy, or else he wouldn't have died on the cross for us if we weren't. And I'm just like, you know what? I'm going to buy my own teddy bear. I'm going to buy my own probably sour candy because I don't really like chocolate. I know that's weird. Um... And I'm just going to do that for myself because I don't need a guy to tell me, hey, you're worthy enough that I'm going to buy you this or buy you that. Because I already know I am great and I am awesome because the Lord tells me that. And I don't need a guy to tell me that. I just need the Lord. So I guess I just want you guys to really, the single ones and the ones who aren't single, that's okay that you have someone if they're good for you and they're strengthening you and they're not pulling you away in a negative way is I mean you need to make sure you're with someone that builds you up and you're with someone that helps strengthen your relationship with Christ and doesn't pull away from it and uh, I think that's really important if you are in a relationship is to just have somebody that is good in your relationship with Christ because if they keep tearing you down then that's not going to be healthy for you but if you are single then go buy your own dang box of chocolates that is okay. It's not weird. I do it. I've done it the last 
few years that I've had my own money to buy it. So just remember that the Lord is the decision maker and he already tells you that you are worthy and that you are great and that you are awesome and you are loved and you don't need someone telling you that you are loved. Don't let somebody else decide your happiness because you will always be let down because people will always disappoint you, but God never, ever, ever, ever will. So just remember that this Valentine's Day and happy love day, happy love week, whatever, and go buy yourself your own box of chocolates, go buy yourself your own roses, and if you're in a relationship, you better get that one something great and make sure that they know you love them and they know that the Lord loves them and you love them because the Lord loves them and just have a great week this week and uh, maybe I'll see you in the store so I'll buy my own box of chocolates. I love you guys, and I hope you guys have a great week, and I'll see you next week. Bye!